After the historic success of the Chandrayaan-3 mission, ISRO is now shooting for the sun with Aditya L1, India's first mission to study the sun up close and personal. So today we are going to tell you about Aditya L1. But before we start, a brief on the importance of studying the sun. Ever wonder what's going on with the sun? It's not just a bright light in the sky. This 4.5 billion year old hot glowing ball of hydrogen and helium powers our entire solar system. And it's why you and I are here today. According to Dr. Ramesh, professor and in charge of science at the Indian Institute of Astrophysics, the sun experiences something called solar quakes or coronal mass ejections. These CMEs can travel at a speed of 3,000 km per second and can wreak havoc on our satellites and communication systems. Remember when Canada lost power for 72 hours in 1989? Or Zurich Airport had some issue in 2017? That's the sun affecting our tech-dependent lives in significant ways. While European Space Agency and NASA have launched similar missions, Aditya L1 is unique. It will observe the solar corona from where it almost starts and will capture the magnetic field changes which are responsible for solar quakes. The journey starts tomorrow at 11.50 a.m. with a liftoff from Sriharikota on an ISRO PSLV rocket. We will stream it live for you on our social media handles. So keep watching this space. Initially, Aditya L1 will be in a low Earth orbit. Gradually, the spacecraft will be propelled towards Lagrange Point or L1. It will take approximately four months to reach its final destination. At Lagrange Point L1, the gravitational pull from the Earth and the Sun will keep the spacecraft stable, allowing constant observation of the Sun with reduced fuel consumption. We are going very close to the Sun, 1.02 or not like that. That's how uh, this mission is very unique. So at the same time, uh, uh, very uh, high risk is there. So uh, this light leaking into the system is a uh, big uh, disaster. So that is taken care at the in the design level uh, with uh, tight uh, tolerance and uh, dimension stability. Uh, this ensured that uh, our instrument will uh, survive all these launch loads and also this orbital heating loads and other things. And it will give the same performance as well in space what it delivered in the lab. Aditya L1 will also carry seven payloads, all made in India. For instance, VELC will study the solar corona and CME dynamics, while SUIT will capture solar photos. Scientists from Bangalore to Pune to Ahmedabad have worked tirelessly on this mission. Data will be processed near Bangalore, enriching India's scientific community like never before. Aditya L1 marks a significant step for India in understanding the sun. It puts India on the map of countries taking a closer look at our closest star. So next time you put on your shades, remember we are getting to know our brightest star even better than ever.